So this becomes so in the denominator we have three like one. So we have minus two square and three and after we have to have this four by two times three minus square by three divided by three. We can say this, we have tons of more columns. So, scale to three. And for a tangent, theta point, we call this theta. Then we have tangent theta point, we call this one over one. Simply, so next is you use the difference of angle for tangent. You have tangent theta which is minus tangent theta which is is the three by the only one is one times two minus the three. You know. We have one minus three square three minus two minus square three. If we simplify that, we have square root three minus one. Three minus the three. Okay, so next we rationalize this uh, expression. So we are multiply this by three plus the square root of three. So we have to multiply by one method in one. Three square root of three. Then minus two square root of three. Then minus three plus three, then this is three. So this cancels out, and this becomes two square root of three. We call the other nine minus six. So this becomes two square root of three over six. Simply the square root of three. Three. So next is we will write this square root of three over three and square root of three over the square root of three square. So we cancel this two then we have to go up square root of three. Then if you draw this to be a right line, then this is actually the thirty sixty ninety one again. This will be Theta to step over. The opposite side be in one. Adjacent side would be the three. And the hypotenuse is two. This is a 16 angle, and this is a 30 degree angle. So our answer will be equal to 30 degrees.
And that is our own council. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you would like to see you for an end. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so we'll be updated for my math videos like this. Thank you.